What's up you wonderful people? Wondrous Lantern here back with another gameplay video. I am going to be playing episode 2 of Palia. This is going to be taking place where we last left off. In episode 1, if you don't remember, I got started. I was in the tent area, or my, my campground area. I guess I was walking around. And then I went to the village, walked around a bit, talked to Asher, Ashura. I learned how to fish, and I spread up on how to hunt, and that's where we last left off. So, without further ado, let's get started. Last thing I did, there was like a deer over here. I have my bow, I believe. And I was learn trying to learn how to hunt, but I was trying to look up how to crouch or, or enter stealth mode or, or something. I don't know if there's a stealth mode in this game. Hmm. Who's that? Oh, is that the golem? Oh! Oh, it's Hecla. That's, um... What's her name? That's, uh, her helper, the person from the beginning. Nice. Well, I just caught my first bug. Actually, uh... Let's also talk to Hecla and see what Hecla has to say. Awaiting input. You seem to be requiring my attention. Let's see. Hecla doesn't really seem to care much about you one way or the other. Why do humans and Majiri keep books locked up in a specific room with only other books to keep them clean? It seems like such a lonely existence for books. Interesting. Okay. Now, back to my Cena. Awaiting input. Wait, do I have any, um... Every day I'm confronted with the dilemma of who to prepare... Of what to prepare for Gina's dinner. Perhaps stuffed mushrooms will suffice? Let's see. Do I have any? I think I have anything that I, that I can give uh, Ekla. Conversation has ceased. So, what was, I was looking up the keybinds, right? I was looking up the keybinds for crouching and trying to sneak. I couldn't find any, but I was also trying to rush. Let's see if we, we can find something. Is there something? Nope, I can't click on these. Hmm. Because I know C, yeah, did the inventory thing. Placement manipulation. Cooking interact prompts. Cooking minigame. Oh, wait. Cooking minigame is my name. Good to read up. Do minigame action. Left. Okay. Never mind. There's got to be something. There's got to be some way to. To crouch, right? Because there's there. I wasn't able to um, sneak up on that deer, or that well, that deer was walking towards me, and I there was, and then it got spooked and ran away. So maybe that's just part of the game. You have to maybe control is just the slow rock. So maybe that's why. Ooh, I mean, I can test it out. Oh. Oh. 
How do I? Just trying to unequip that. Where did that deer run to? Is that it? It is. Hmm. Overflowing bounty. It looks like your inventory is full. Extra items are stored in overflow for a limited time to help manage your inventory safe, but that's pretty cool mechanic. Eventually, items will in overflow are destroyed or replaced by new ones to treat, treat a full inventory seriously. Understood. Gotcha. Okay, so let's, uh... What do I have? Ooh, can I... I probably should eat, because it looks like something of my... I have a bar up. Oh, the focus bar. Okay. Focus increasing. Focus is, is as simple as eating. When you earn experience, some of your focus is used to increase the total experience earned. Your focus bonus is 20%. This uh, can be increased by spending renown at shrines. Okay. So, I need to eat, essentially. Okay, so to put the arrow away, I uh, press the the um, uh, right mouse button. That's uh, that's how you do that. Select destination. I don't want to go, but yeah, that's cool. That there's a fast travel system. I need to figure out how to eat. It's got to be a place in, in town. Furniture store, library, general store, tailor, tavern, blacksmith, city hall, apothecary, villagers. Okay. Just can't figure out where to go. Why don't you start how about making campfire for your place? Once you start grilling up mushrooms like a champ, we'll get you started on a on the complicated stuff. Okay. Well, you know where to find me. So Yeah, let's uh let's head back to my place. I believe it was this one, right? Okay. Yeah, I think. I think my is this my place to ha housing plot? Okay, housing plot is this way. Cool. Hmm. Come on, dude, run, 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 run. Visiting friends. Why not say hello to a friend? Drop um, in on a friend while they're home. Interact with sign. Sign. Okay. First, let's. Uh, I actually totally forgot how to build or the engine. Do I have to go here to craft this fire? I do. Campfire. Let's do it. Let's make. It.
Oh, so I really put stuff in my, uh... I don't know what this stuff is, so... Just move all this stuff. fish too. Let's try to I might need wood for fire. But, uh, so I have to press four since it's four in my hotbar to take the camp out. Place it in front of my tent a bit. Let's give it a little like make it diagonal. Give it some like some uh some personality I guess. What I was trying to say there. Let's grill some grilled mushroom. I only have two or three mushrooms. Okay. So I'm gonna have to go find mushrooms. Because I cannot grill anything or make anything else. Oh. Ooh, there's a mushroom right here. Bell. Must be like a time of day type of bell. Good mushroom. Okay, so it's got a timed cooking system, so just gotta wait it out. Eat a grilled mushroom to gain focus, okay? Let's, uh, mushrooms right there. How do I... Oh, okay. So when it's selected, I can uh, right mouse button and consume it. Just as it says in my my focus at the top left corner there, it says it went up a bit. So let's see. Uh, 0, 50, use 50 focus. Any mushroom, so I can cook any mushrooms. So I go around my house and plot, collect some mushrooms. I wanted to fish in my small little pond here after I learned how to fish, so I'm gonna do that. Put this next series of mushrooms. I wonder if there's any reason for the tent. Because I haven't had to really use the tent any or anything. I haven't had to go to sleep, so we'll see. Okay, so you can eat mushrooms raw. Ooh. Why is it in my... Oh. oh. I don't know what this is. Market woven basket. Customization value. Item cannot be sold. A lightweight basket made from woven strips of bamboo could theoretically double as very large steamer. Okay. I don't know what that is, so I'm just gonna put it in my bin right here. Potato pod prize bag. Contains one random select like potato pod. Okay. Um I don't know how to do that stuff yet. I'm assuming it's like a 
like a shovel and like a, 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 a like an agricultural type of mechanic, you know, like gardening. So we'll see. All right, let me uh fish. Let's try and fish. Let's see if I can actually fish in my small pond. Ah. But uh, I'm not fishing there. No, I can't. No. Oh, darn. Try fishing in more open area and cast it out. Oh. I'm gonna leave here with one fish. Come on. Uh, I wonder if you can eat fish raw. I probably should check that out. I shouldn't even try that. Let's see what this open tour board, open store. It's the store board. Home tours. Welcome to home tours. Here you can earn unique rewards by exploring other players' homes and submitting your own. I think I have to wait for the timer to run out. You can open this tab to browse the homes other players have uploaded. Okay. And I, maybe if I press escape, it does the next one. Okay, it does. Or open to the My Home tab to submit your own plot or track information about a plot you've already submitted. Okay. Want some fresh ideas? You can also tour an inspiration plot. Okay. Touring homes. Here you can see the homes that the players have submitted. You can also get some info about each home at a glance, such as the most popular reaction given by other visitors. I don't know where that's at. I'm assuming it's this whole box. Have someone specific in mind. As long as you, they have successfully submitted their home, you can enter their name here to find them. Okay. And why don't you check it out? Just pick a home and select the shiny gold tour home button to get great new ideas. Okay, let's see. Submitting your home here, you can select and submit which of your housing slots you like other players to tour. Once you submit a housing slot, it will be sub it will be submitted for the rest of the week. Then you can come back next week to submit again. Okay. Let's see. Animal Crossing? What? Alright, I got it. I got it to that one. But it's some it's it's called Animal Crossing. It's gotta it's gotta live up to that name, right? Welcome to Animal Crossing, created by Lend Rendrick. Uh, during a tour, you can select a reaction to express how you feel about it. And press Q and E to select reaction tolerance. Okay, cool. If you change your mind later, you can submit a different reaction instead. Okay. And when you are finished touring, you can use these options to tour to tour the next home in the list or return to tour tickets. You have earned some tour tickets from touring other players' homes. You can access the home tours store at the store board to exchange your tickets for exclusive rewards like nameplates and jukeboxes. Cool. Alright. Oh, okay. So, th I don't know how they got rid of their, uh, fence. That's pretty cool. That's, uh... Oh, I get it. Animal cross. So it's like animals, and they're crossing on a street. Okay, that's clever. I like that. Uh, 
and see which one is it. So cute, very cool, how cozy, that's amazing. I'm gonna say how cool, because that is a pretty cool concept. That is a cool idea. I get it. I, I'm smart sometimes. Asterisk. Alright, so... Uh, I think that's it. I don't think there's anything else I can do here. And then, yeah, I can't access any of the, the other stuff. But I'm very. I I want to. I want to know how they got rid of their fence. Maybe it's something that you can do. They are down the line. Let's do a toy board. Oh. Oh, I should probably should have used the command in the hot bar. That would have probably got me somewhere else. More, um, what I was trying to do. Whoa. Okay. That, this is a cool home. I didn't even think you could go this big. Whoa. Yeah, that is, this is amazing. That is well earned. Well earned. Cool little, like, uh, water uh, fountain outside. Oh, it's even got a little, like, a little, um, uh, orb at the top that's kind of trying to do the physics with it. Torn off. Oh, that is so cool. You can actually turn off the water and the, the, the sphere at the top stops. That's cool. I'm gonna, instead of going inside first, let's, let's look around. I want to see what this we've got. Let's come to the left here. We've got, looks like a sawmill of some sort, maybe a furnace, got some barrels, cool, and an anvil. So this is like, this seems to be their crafting area. Really cool, I like it. You can garden, I was right. That is cool. You have a garden here. It's all organized and it looks nice. It is very cool. I'm assuming this is like a guest house or something like that. Yes, it is, it looks like, open. Okay, a little, like a little dragonfly bed here. Got to Change clothes. Oh, cool! You can actually get a um, wardrobe. This is the wardrobe where you can plan new outfits and swap between ones you've already saved. Okay, that's cool. Saved outfits. Let's sew that right here. If you want to save your current outfit, press this button, then go to the collections menu. Open any player menu. Uh, and click the collections button in the upper right to add any saved outfits to a wheel you can access in the world just like your emote and tool wheels. That is pretty cool. So let's go here. What's this? One moment. Show off your style. That purchase bonus. Unlock one pal cat with your first pallion coin purchase. Unlock three additional types of pal cats once you purchase your first 3,000 plus pal. What? Wait, how do I uh, save out this stuff here? Okay, so I'm gonna save this one. I'm just gonna name it. I, oh, I think I can name it. Okay, perfect. Oh, let's uh, go back. I wanna. Not owned. Anything else? Okay. Accessories. Wait a minute. You can get circular shades. Yes, I love circular shades. It's like my favorite thing. Not mm, of those ones. These ones actually, because they're green. Okay, that's pretty cool. What is that? Ethereal. Oh, okay. It's just like a floating halo. Oh, that's pretty cool. Nice. Sort it to oh I guess not. 
it might automatically put what I own up at the top. Okay. Let's see the tops. Okay, this is cool. So I can. So this will be like my wandering. Or whatever, but I can change my. Uh, maybe if I'm going. One that had really cool neck. There we go. I like it. Yeah. Was it this one? No, it was this one. Yeah. Change that. Change the pants to. Well, that's cool. Oh, that's cool. You can add the makeup and stuff for it. Okay. Hair. Maybe I'll make this one more. I can make it like more regal. Although it doesn't look like that. Maybe this. Yeah, I like that. Save this. That's cool. I like that a lot. Let's, I wonder how you change it, so I'm... Alright, anyway, let's continue my tour. Oh, he's got a jukebox here, that is cool. Alright. I wonder what these little platforms are. Besides... Okay, this is really cool. This game just opened up in ways I didn't think. I thought you were just going to have one small little housing plot the whole time. Not that that would have been bad, it was like a, um, a la uh, Animal Crossing, but this is cool. This is really cool, I like that. I bet you as you progress through the game, you're going to get more um, real estate. Uh, let's see, so I was at the guest house, come back, oh, actually no, we circle around. So it looks like he's got somewhere to go from there. I don't know where that would be. Oh my gosh, he's got like a... This person's... This person's got... Like a town. It's like just... I just went over to the back and it looked like there were several buildings. Yeah, look at this. This is amazing. Really cool. This is really cool. I, I, I'm i enjoying this design, and I'm just enjoying the fact that this has opened my eyes up as well. A little, uh, swim. Or not swim, a little, like, jacuzzi or something. Okay, so Fireplace, nice like fire area. Sorry, I'm not trying to walk all of your furniture. This is just so cool. Wow. The amount of time. Like it's the small details too. Like the amount of time it took probably took to make this. Of course, you gotta have the, the coins. Okay, so you got a fish. There's a gems. Open chest of pearls. Oh! That's cool. So it's even more of like a special animated chest. This is awesome, man. Let's go upstairs. Let's see what we got. Looks like 
Bug, black, animal plaques, cool, cool stuff on the walls. Ooh, that's Ashura, isn't it? It looks like it, yep. Get out! I couldn't get up. Oh, I didn't go up here. I don't think. Oh wait, I did. Cause isn't this where the bathroom is? The oh no, it isn't. This is a different restaurant. Oh, that's cool. I know I did come here. I cause I went to the left. Okay. God, this is so so in depth. I like this. Really good job. Really good job. Alright, well that does it about for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. I will still continue my journey through the Palia world. This one was a little longer because I I had to look through that house and I had to share my experience with that house. I think it was called Palian Home. There's a way for me to check right over here. I'm going to do that real quick. Um, really, this one. Palian Show Home. Definitely give it a... Give it Give it a look out, guys, if you guys are interested. That was really cool. I like that. But anyway, as always, I hope you guys are having a great day, staying safe, and stay weird. Until next time.